Hey guys, it's Jessica and I'm back with another new video. So for today's video, I'm going to be showing you what is in my school backpack. And I chose to film this video because I'm a very organized person. But the last couple of months, I've just kind of been so stressed out. So I feel like there's just a lot of weird objects in my backpack. I feel like my backpack is a representation of that and I just wanted to see what was in it. And it's just one way for me to empty out my backpack since I'm on my summer break now. So this is my backpack. Oh my gosh, it's ginormous. It's actually like bigger than me. But it's a North Face backpack. So I'm going to start on the outside of the bag and work my way in. So I have my two water bottle pockets on this side right here. And the first one, I have an actual water bottle. So... Oh, there's so much junk. Ew. Ew. So gross. Ew. I have a bunch of pretzels and little hair elastics along with hair and then some coins. That's so gross. Ew. <laughs> Disgusting. I have a lot of Ziploc bags. And that's just because I'm a snacker. Okay, I have a set of peanut butter crackers that is like all crumbs. I think it's just the peanut butter that's keeping it together, but it's like so crumbly another chest okay i have a tootsie pop wrapper oh it has a star on it that's probably why i kept it <laughs> ew something was wet ew, ew. <laughs> i have something green and wet on my hand and i don't know what it is ew that's so gross not like mold but like that's disgusting moving on the bottom of my right water bottle thing I have. I don't even know what these are called. I think they're called binder clips, but I have one of these. I don't think I've ever used it. Oh, no, I know what this is for. Okay, so here's my phone, right? I have a life proof case and the little charger port when I just got it, it was too hard to open up. It would like hurt my finger and I could never get it up. So I figured out that the edge of this would just like <laughs> pop it. And I could do that without like breaking my nails. So I totally remember putting this in there. But I haven't used it in like 7 months. Because I totally like loosened this up. Okay not 7 months but like 5 months. And then I have also coins and just some candy. I think that's a chocolate kiss wrapper. This is so gross. I'm like a clean person. I let it get too messy. Okay I'm going to start with the top little pouch pocket. This shouldn't be too bad. This is like not bad. So I have my ID pouch. I just have my ID with some coins and receipts and stuff like that. Just stuff that you need at school. Like some extra cash. You know, chill. And then I have two chapsticks. And then I have a hairbrush. This hairbrush has been in my bag or like in my backpacks I think for like three years. I got this and I want to say seventh or sixth grade. But I've had this for like the longest time ever. So that will always be in like a purse or a bag of mine. Then I have some allergy pills. Um, <laughs> it's kind of random, but I have like horrible allergies and sometimes I'll just forget to take an allergy pill in the morning and then I'll be like dying at school. So we uh, were smart and we got an extra bottle that I could take with me at school. So I just have my Apple earbuds. And I have some... <laughs> I have so many weird things in my backpack. This is so awkward. Okay, then I have um, some cream. And as I said, I have allergies. So this is try on cinnamon cream. And it's just like, um, like if you have an itch and then like itch and then cream, like allergies. I don't even know. And then I have, oh, <laughs> this is a little slip of paper. And it came in a box with a lock. Um, the lock that goes to my gym locker. It has like the combination on it and everything. So if I ever forgot my combination, I just kept this in my backpack. Um, I don't think I ever used it, but that's really smart thinking, so. <laughs> and I have a phone charger. I've had this cord for like the longest time. I feel like you always need a phone charger at school or someone else does. And then you can be like their new best friend because you just gave them a phone cord. And I have um, some little, what are these called? I call them like little clips. They're not barrettes, but... They're like little hair clips. So I have some little clips. I have another little clip and another little clip and a bobby pin. So a lot of hair stuff. Uh, four more bobby pins. <laughs> and then a quarter, another bobby pin, another quarter, another bobby pin, more coins, and another hair clip. This is all in one pocket. Oh my gosh. <laughs> more bobby pins. And that's it for the front pocket. <laughs> if you ever need a bobby pin you know where to find one. Okay, now I'm moving on to the second pocket, which is smaller than the last pocket. My makeup bag. 
This is another little pencil pouch, but this was in my locker, and on the last day of school, I cleaned out my locker, and so all my locker stuff was in here, and it's not that much at all. I opened this on the last day of school. I was like, this would have been really helpful, but I have like brand new pens and pencils and glue and whiteout and erasers, and I was like, that was so smart, but it wasn't smart to not keep it in my backpack. Here's what like the inside pocket looks like. It has, oh my gosh, this is so heavy, okay. Um, it has like a um, pocket <laughs> there, and then this is what I keep like my everyday pins and stuff in, and then here is a little zipper pouch and little like elastic things over here, and then uh, at the very bottom there's like little pockets. <laughs> Sorry, it's really heavy. It's like super heavy. So in the little pin pocket, I just have... Um, a pink pin on this in the hallway at school and I was like, hmm, it's mine now. And then this pin, well that pin is my sister's pin and she threw it at me. It just, I was like a joking way, don't worry, it's like fine. But uh, I took it because she threw it at me so I'm not going to give it back. Then I have a black pin and then I think this is my last pencil. There's literally no eraser on it and there's lead in it. And then I have a Sharpie which I found in the hallway again. And then lastly, I just have my highlighters. And I keep all four of them in that little pocket because I use them all like at the same time for color coding. Like um, whether it's like math or English or anything like that, I just keep them all together right there. And then in this pocket right there, I have... Oh! So my friend Aggie, she went on a field trip and I don't even know how she got this or something. But um, this is for like um, an interior designer place thing and she saw it and thought of me because I want to be an interior designer and I thought it was so sweet and she picked it up for me. And so it's just kind of like um, some information on how to be one and stuff like that. It's really, really crumpled because I put it next to my laptop in my back pocket and then I shoved my laptop down in and I forgot this was there so it's all crumpled but um, I still have it so I thought that was really sweet that she thought of me and brought it to me so that was cute I have some mail I remember um, putting this in my bag actually because I came home and this was there that would be important okay so here's what it looks like it's just like this I don't know something that I was invited to and there's tickets inside <laughs> and I remember putting this in my backpack so I could see it every day and be like oh this is important like show this to your parents like um it's just like the first time that I'm actually looking at this and they're VIP tickets and they're $150 each and I have two of them so I literally wasted $300 by accident oh I feel so bad I don't even know like what it's for next I have a seminar pass so this is just like a pass so you can leave your seminar teacher and go somewhere else so pretty cool pretty cool I never used it but <laughs> um, then I have my agenda, which is the cutest agenda ever. I love this so much. I think it's so pretty. And I use an agenda like every single day to write down my homework. And I stopped using it. I had so much homework and there was so much to write that there wasn't enough room. But I just used um, the notes app on my phone to record my homework after that. But I'm going to keep using this because this will go through... Please go through the summer. Okay, it goes through to June. And then I have my To Kill a Mocking Bird book. So I just had to annotate the whole thing. So if anybody wants an annotated To Kill a Mockingbird book, um, hit me up. And then I have... Um, Oh, yeah. Okay, so I took health this semester, and we had a guest speaker come in and talk about suicide and depression and stuff like that. So this just has um, some, like, crisis hotlines and symptoms for depression and, like, what to do and stuff like that. Ah, another seminar pass. Okay, then I have some sticky notes. Can you see that? I have a bobby pin, and I, like, made it. I was trying to make a heart but it just wouldn't bend any farther can you see that can you see that can you see i try to make it a heart but i don't think you can see that um so yeah i just had some extra time on my hands and then i have a uh, compass i've had this for three years they always say you need one never needed one and then in the very bottom i have oh my gosh that's so gross i have an old hershey bar <laughs> that's from halloween ew <laughs> 
Ew. But I have some little sticky notes for like um, book pages and I used those during To Kill a Mockingbird and for my agenda. Aggie, I do carry a paper clip. Ew. I have, this is so gross, an opened thing of Sweetheart Hearts from Valentine's Day. And there's three left, so, and a bobby pin. Okay, well, this is where all my bobby pins are going. I thought my sister was taking them, but I guess I was. <laughs> okay, so I'm done with the first two pockets right here. Now moving on to, like, the lower backpack. I have just, like, a little pouch. And then I have my calculator. And then on this little elastic band right there, I carry bobby pins just on the side of it. That's where all my bobby pins were supposed to go, but... That didn't happen. Then I have a red pen and a black pen and a nail file. This, you may think I'm crazy for carrying this at school, but I have broken my nail so many times and I've needed this. And it has actually come in handy for like other people because they're always like, I need a nail file. And I'm like, mm -hmm, I got you because nobody carries one. So therefore, I carry one. And then in the zipper pocket, I have all of my pens and some white out. And then I have two erasers and a little... Oops. <gasps> No! I know what this is for. So, I was in sewing, and I was making a lanyard. But she had a binder ring, so I was like, well, that'll help me figure out the measurements. In the very bottom of the bag. Ew. 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 You don't know what happened, but ew. I stuck my hand down, and there's this old deodorant, and it has... Yeah, I'll, like, show it to you. Ew, 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 it's sticky. Ew, 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 Anybody who watches this video is gonna think I'm so gross. Like, actually, I'm really organized. It was just the last two months and I was stressed out. And I don't have time to keep anything clean. Ew, it was sticky. Okay, so I have this deodorant in the very bottom. You can see here, there's, like, sticky... Ew, ugh, I touched it. There's, like, sticky red stuff all next to it. Ugh. I don't even know what the sticky red stuff is. But that was in the bottom of my bag. I really thought this was kind of clean. Oh, I'm not I'm not this dirty. Like that never happens with me. I'm a clean person. Okay, in the very, very bottom, I'm like scared to put my hand down there again. Ew. Oh my gosh, why is everything so sticky? Ew. There is mushed up chocolate and bobby pins. Ew. I'm gonna have to like I don't even know. What is that? Okay, I'm gonna go wash my hands because that was disgusting. I'm back, but if I find another sticky item, I'm going to throw up. I don't like being sticky. It just... <sighs> okay, now onto the main pocket. I wonder, can you dry clean a backpack? I think you could. I think you can. The main pocket. I'm just gonna go through it. So the thing on top that I have is some deodorant. Um, some actual good deodorant, not the sticky one. And I have a package of bobby pins. This is where all the bobby pins came from. <laughs> so as I said before, I cleaned out my locker on the last day of school. What I had in my locker were like three or four things. So I had this um, notebook, and this is actually Bethany Moda's notebook that I colored, and I think it turned out really cute. But I had this for one of my classes, and we never ended up needing a spiral for that class, so I just kept it in my locker just in case I needed it, but it's super cute. Then I have some grid paper, and I've had this grid paper, I think, since 6th grade, and I've never needed it. So, oh my gosh, that's so cool. It's like regular lined paper on the back, but grid on the other side. So cool. Um, but I just keep it with me in my locker every single year, just in case, because I feel like we would need grid paper. Then this is kind of an odd one. I bet no one else has this in their backpack. But these are some zebra ears. Um, yeah, they were in my locker, and it was for the freshman dance. It was uh, safari-themed. And I was a giraffe, and some of my friends were zebras, so I made zebra ears for some people. So this is what they turned out looking like. One of them, it was Hayden. She forgot to take hers home, or she didn't want it, because I don't know why I wouldn't want to be a zebra. But, so yeah, I was a zebra, so... <laughs> so yeah, that's what was in my locker. And then I have all of my spirals and stuff. So my spirals are actually organized. So it goes my spiral and then the matching notebook and then spiral and matching notebook and the hours. So like first hour, second hour, third hour. So that's organized. But it's all organized by first semester's hours and stuff like that. Not second semester's, but you know, it's organized still. This is my geometry notebook. Literally, 
so full. Then I have the matching notebook. And then I have my whale folder. I can't take myself seriously in these ears. This folder is actually for my video productions class. And I was making a storyboard. You can tell I try really hard on my storyboards. And I draw the best stick figures. Obviously. So yeah, that's that folder. And then the matching um, notebook for it was the Bethany Moda one. But that one in my locker, so... Then I have this folder. Ah, okay, this is my sewing folder. So this is everything from sewing. And then I have this folder. And it's the cutest spiral ever. Social studies folder and notebook. But I never used either because we did everything online. So this notebook has like three pages done. Or with some nice doodles, so. Oh, <laughs> This is funny. I did it with Shelby, so Shelby, if you're watching this, you should text me and tell me what this was for because I don't remember exactly what the assignment was, but we had to draw a picture. So she did like the writing portion and I did the drawing portion. So I drew an elephant and I drew a tree. Bang, pew, 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 pew. Yeah, but anyway, so I have that. That's really funny. <laughs> But then I have my biology stuff, which if you know me, I hate biology. So I have my spiral and then my matching notebook. My notebook is literally so ripped. And then I have my stuff for drama. So I drew this really cute notebook cover. And I had like little flowers and like little speckles sprouting out. Oh, it had like a name tag right here too. And then I didn't glue it enough or the glue. I used a glue stick, so wasn't gonna be the best and like most secure thing to do but it totally ripped off so now it's just you know chilling um but i used this so much who knew you wrote so much in drama oh <laughs> forgot about this but we did theater history notes literally i'm sorry i so did not like it then i have my drama folder this just has like scripts and stuff like that. The last notebook I have is my English one. We use the English journal. Look how cute these are. Um, we use the English journal, like this spiral, more than any other spirals that I had. I get really bored, so there's a lot of doodles in here randomly. Okay, so I would do these at the top of like all my pages. Literally took me so long. But yeah, they're just like little circles that all connect to each other. There's a pattern for it. But um, so yeah, there's definitely a pattern. But, like, after we do our journal entries and she's just, like, talking and I'm just chilling with my journal open, I'm just like, do-do-do-do-do, so, yeah, yeah. And then I have um, my English folder, which just has a bunch of paper, Shakespeare, all uh, uh, <laughs> this is microwave popcorn and, ew, it's, like, butter all over the place, but... I put that in there for lunch one day because I was just in the mood for popcorn and then I totally forgot about it. I guess it was just in the bottom of my bag. And then I have, ooh, whoops, this, which is all crumpled up now and I feel kind of bad. Our musical, the Seussical that we did this year, we won eight Blue Star Ribbon Awards or Blue Star Awards for it. And this is the ceremony invite thing for it. But, you know, but it was such a good show. Literally so good. Ew. What is that? Oh, I think they're almonds. Ew. <laughs> this was a baggie of almonds. Ew, this bag is so gross. Oh, this is part of my journal cover. Drama! <laughs> you can tell, like, I'm a snacker. Ooh, gross. Okay, here's an opened Jolly Rancher that's completely glued to the sheet of paper. I can't believe I let my bag get this mess. This is the messiest my bag has ever been. The most that has ever been in my bag would be like literally nothing. Like my bags are so clean, but this year, whew. fruit snacks, like a whole package of fruit snacks. <laughs> and then here's my laptop portion. Like that's where you put your laptop. I don't think there's any, oh, there's something in there. Oh yeah. Okay, I should just learn that I should not put paper where my laptop goes because I forget about it. It's like nicely flat and like contained and like that little pouch. But then I shove my MacBook in it and then it's ruined. Um, then I have my ruler. This ruler comes in handy because literally no one carries a ruler in school. And 
Oh, that really hurt. That really, really hurt. Okay, so my nail broke and it just smacked it. Oh, that hurts so bad. Yeah, that's it. That's what's in my bag. I'll zip it up so you can actually see like what my bag looks like. Okay, so yeah, this is like what it looks like. It's super cute. It's gray and mint, which are my favorite colors. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and saw how gross my bag was. That's actually really embarrassing. I'm a clean person. It's just, I... I snack a lot. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, then be sure to leave it a big thumbs up. Because then I'll know that you liked it. And then maybe I'll do this again next year. And hopefully it's not as dirty. Also, I just wanted to give credit to Brooklyn and Bailey's channel. Because they were the first people that I saw do this video. So I didn't come up with this idea. And I haven't seen anybody else film this video except for them. So yeah, I just thought this was such a fun video. And that I should film it too. Because obviously I had some gross stuff in my bag. I want you guys to comment um, what's going on right now. So like if you are done with school. If you're taking finals. If you have another month left of school. Something like that. So where you are in your life right now. And also if you are done with school. Then tell me what the weirdest thing you found in your backpack was. So then I can like know that I'm not alone with this whole weird gross thing. So, so again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys next time. So bye guys. Love you. Thank <laughs> you.